All right, you guys, so we're gonna do a sister haul. And so, we'll Kristen- lock the door just in case, in the, the safe area. <laughs> no, we should lock the door. That's, it automatically We're in a parking lot because <laughs> Kristen lives like 15 minutes that way and I live 15 minutes behind us. Yeah. And so, and it's late, so we don't wanna go to a house. And so we're filming it in a car. So we're gonna do a sister haul, okay? Cause we went, we had a shopping spree. So Kristen got, I wish I brought my nicer camera, but that's okay. So she got the Too Faced uh, palette, the natural at night. Is it too much different than the bear? The yeah, bear the well, there it was just a, has a couple of there was another one we both darker. really liked. It was like bear face or something like that. It was it was really pretty too. I liked them both. I would kind of want them both, honestly. Yeah. All right, so here we go. But that that's so new. And guys, like, we are new. in. It's nighttime and we are in a car, so it's it's like looks the pal the shades aren't going to look quite as pretty, but it's gorgeous. So, and as all Too Faced products, it comes with like little tutorial cards to give you some idea. So she got that. That's then, nice. I have been dying to get this, and so I was telling Kristen about it, so we both got one. But this is the um, Pore Professional. <laughs> uh, it is uh, by Benefit, and it's the Pore Minimizing. You can put it on over your makeup or under it, which I think putting it over your makeup sounds weird. But anyway, we did an example yeah. on um, my wrist. And like I said, this is not the bright lighting to do, but literally the lines on my wrist disappeared. Did they yeah. not? Like yeah. in front of our eyes, this stuff is amazing. <laughs> Cannot wait to use it. Yeah, I wish I could about it. She got the Urban Decay 24 seven waterproof liquid liner, which she tried in the store and it was great. It went on and it didn't smear unless you rubbed it a ton. Yeah. So it was one of those things that we liked it because it seemed like it wouldn't be, some things that are waterproof are really hard to get off. This seemed like this one wouldn't be, but at the same time, it was not smearing with just normal mm -mm. effort. It, 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 okay, this, it peeled off. Mm -hmm. like, like it, it. Yeah, like flaked off yeah, almost. Like, but not in a super, like it, it's hard almost to like, like, I don't know, like when you put a really thick layer of like, um, nail polish on you can almost just like peel it yeah off. almost like i know that sounds weird. it sound that sounds weird it sounds unappealing but it was really no. cool and it, it you said it went on smooth yes very smooth. and it had a really good point mm -hmm. and she got it in perversion which is just like the blackest black so so this she this this is like the second or third set of swipes to get it to look like that oh wow even the cover up on my tattoo is like it's so working really uh -huh. we put that Sorry. poor moisturizer on it earlier so that there she had to use makeup wipes to get them like, and so look it comes off easily but not but, but easily. it doesn't because yeah one swipe because you don't two, want to yeah three. look at that three swipes but just a little a little bit of pressure a little pressure and it, and it comes right off it's, it's, so this is the perfect because it's going to stay on but it's also not going to kill you to take it off yeah. and then she got some um the urban decay eyeshadow primer potion so she got the shadow primer. This is just to keep your eyeshadow on and from creasing throughout the day. I have this and it works wonderfully. So that's what she got. All right, so then she got the um, Just Bitten, oh, there we go, stain. lip stain. And what color is this? Twilight, Twilight, Twilight. All right, that's really pretty. Uh, makeup wipes. Makeup wipes. Name brand. <laughs> The CVS brand actually works really they well. They do, and then uh, just a little bit. Oh, she got these to try because I told her to. So guys, we're both, we're not really like press on nail type of people. However, yeah. I got these to try for free and I ended up really liking them. And so I told her to try them too. So she's gonna try them. The one she got, like once again, this camera is not picking it up great, but they're yeah. really pretty. They're really simple. This one's basically just got a little like shimmery coat on the end and it's like a plane now, but really fun. I hope you like them. And I hope they don't stick too much. They don't. That's what I liked about them. Okay, and then she got this Physician's Formula um, Glowing Nude Blush. So. I love Physician's Yeah, me too. This always goes on really pretty. I have to get the fun cheap, packaging the cheap too. Blush and stuff since Anytime your makeup says nude right on the product. <laughs> Was I'm that the it? Chocolate Man. That's, that's it. it. That's it. That's her. That's the sister haul featuring her hands. <laughs> okay, so now it's my turn for my part of the sister shopping haul. So we did Kristen's, my sister, in the car because <laughs> she had to get home. So I'm going to do mine real quick. The kids are mostly asleep, but I have one little friend over there. So we're going to see if we can do this. So first, um, we went to a department store, to JCPenney. And I really was going there to go to Sephora, but we ended up getting some other things too. So I found this. 
it's like a little poncho, but really stylish, and it's it's a thick, nice, sweatery material. Super fun for Sophia. And this is the Little Maven line by Tori Spelling, and I got it for $6.97. How awesome is that? So, super, super pretty and cute and warm. And she can just throw it. She has a bunch of uh, white weight long sleeve shirts that this is a really easy way to warm it up and then take them off. Then she got this dress. Look at how sweet this dress is. Isn't this beautiful? It's a, a really thin corduroy material. So warmer than just, you know, so a little warmer but not too warm. This is also the Little Maven line by Tori Spelling. And I got it for that price, which is amazing. Okay. Next, this looks really shapeless, but I promise it was really pretty on. This is by um, St. John's Bay, which I've actually never really heard of. But I tried this on because my sister actually found this. I don't think I would have tried this on normally on my own. It's a peasant top. And it's really, really pretty. And it looked so fun on over, I was wearing a, like a purpley plum colored tank top and it looked awesome. It was flowy and pretty and looks shapeless not on a hanger. I mean, it looks shapeless when it's not on, but it was really, really pretty on. And then last, I got this little sweater onesie. It's a little knit sweater onesie, which I think is just adorable. I got this for Audrey. Um, we're still having some cold weather, so I wanted her to have one other cold outfit. And so this is by Giggle Baby. Most of the things I thought were really kind of overpriced, but I got this for $4.97. What a deal. Oh, and one more thing with this that I forgot to mention was I got Sophia, my four-year-old, a ballerina nightgown because it was too adorable to not get for her and she loves that kind of thing but she insisted on wearing it the second we got home so next we have our drugstore haul so we went to just um, a local drugstore we went to CVS and this is what I got there I got um, some fun nail stickers to try I thought these were really pretty look at that and along with it, I also, I thought you can put them on clear, but you can put them over polish. And so I bought this polish, which I thought was really beautiful. It's a really, really pale nude pink color, which I thought would look good with these. It would look kind of like the picture. And this is the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Brilliant Nail Gloss, and it is in natural blush. All right, and then I have always wanted to try these. I've tried other brands and I actually was surprised because I liked them and so um, I've never tried the Essie ones, but um, I've been wanting to, so I just went ahead and picked them up. That's what they look like. And like I said, I've actually tried this type of thing before and was surprised because I liked it. Next, I got, this is my favorite BB cream. Um, I like it more than like things that I've tried that were literally four or five times the cost of this and I love this one so much and they were having a special so I got two because I'll use it and I just absolutely love the coverage of this um it just it really really does make my skin look great I actually got this originally I got one of these to try and I am um, I love it so much that <laughs> I've used it ever since so and then I just picked up some precision tip cotton swabs the ones with little points because sometimes I have trouble getting the nail polish out of like corners. So, and then I picked up just some basic nail polish remover. This is a drugstore brand. And then I usually use Alme, um, the oil free eye makeup remover pads, but I'm going to try the um, drugstore brand and see if I like them just as well because they were a lot less expensive. So, we'll see. Uh, my sister recommended this top coat. She really liked it, so I thought I'd try it. And then um, I picked up this to use as a highlighter from Physicians Formula, and um, I, I have, th there was a highlighter I used to use from them that I loved that they discontinued, and so I'm hoping that this one maybe has the same effect because I've bought several more since then, and I've bought like the really nice expensive ones, and none of them live up to the original one I had from them, so I'm hoping that this does it. 
And then I got some mints because I'm about to go on a film job and I talk to a lot of people. So I want to make sure I have mints so that if I eat lunch and don't have time to not, you know, where I can run, brush my teeth, I can pop some mints. <laughs> and then um, I'm just trying out this mascara. I try out new mascaras all the time and kind of have my list of favorites. I always use waterproof or water resistant mascara because um, quite frankly, the other kinds just don't work on me. They smear, so I always have to have waterproof. So anyway, this is a new one. I've never tried it and I'm gonna see if I like it. And then I just got um, an eyeliner, just a basic eyeliner with a smudger on it. So that was my drugstore haul. Okay, next, Sephora. This is the whole reason I went to JCPenney to the department store was I wanted this and they've been out of this on Amazon and they've been out of it off and on on their own website so it's been hard to get and I went and they were out of it but I asked and they had hidden one away and they gave it to me so <laughs> I think someone had asked them to hold it for them but they never came back so I got it so I'm really really excited about that um, one of my best friends got me the Naked 2 palette a year or so ago and I love it and I think this one has the palette colors are going to be even more up my alley so I'm so so excited to try this I just love it when I've seen the reviews of it and then I have been eyeballing this for over a year and I've tried it out like five times and every time I try it out I'm like it's amazing so I finally just you know got it I was like I'm buying it <laughs> so I got this as did my sister all right and then um, since I'm a beauty insider, Sephora, whatever they call it, it's their little card program, it's free. Um, you earn points and things like that, and you also get birthday gifts. And so I didn't even remember that, so I was buying my stuff, and the girl goes, Oh, it's your birthday, so, <laughs> or your birthday month. So she's like, you get a birthday gift. And so I got, um, they gave me a benefit, a mascara, which was probably awesome, but I don't know how much I'll wear because, again, I don't wear non-waterproof mascara. And then also the Watts Up, <laughs> which is cute, which is just a um, little, like, uh, little glow stick, which this I am super excited about. If I like it, I'm going to buy the big version. So what I liked about this birthday gift, what was so cool is that they're not huge, but they're definitely not sample size. They're the next step up, more like a travel size, which is really cool that I just get this for free, you know? So, and that is what I got from Sephora. So there we go. There's our haul that we did. We had fun shopping. And as you can tell, it was really, really, really girly shopping. <laughs>